Bella Goth has just returned from an extremely successful date with her new man, Benedict. We're gonna get her into bed quite promptly. We do have work in the morning at 7 a.m. as usual, and I'd really like to see if we can get her promoted because I really think she's had enough of being in this position. It's half past three, but we're getting up bright and early because our needs do need a little bit of attention. I think we've just gotten a little bit out of sync because we were downtown for such a long time on our extremely successful date. It's kind of like being jet lagged when you get back home and it's a different time. So we're just catching up with that. Carpool is coming in an hour. Is it going to be fun or hunger that gets attention? I think it's going to be fun. Okay, off we go. So regarding Benedict, our love life is definitely humming along, which is really exciting. But I do think we should just make it clear to him that he's not the only important thing in our life. We are absolutely pursuing our career, full throttle ahead, so to speak. And I would also like to get Bella involved in some new hobbies. She's not just doing something for a man. This isn't the kind of person she is. She wouldn't have survived this long on her own if everything that she was doing was for somebody else. So we're just having some dinner and then I'd like to just quickly work on our creativity skill before we go to bed. Although our energy is so low, I don't think we'll be able to do that for very long. Let's get Bella to bed. Let's turn off the TV because it's getting irritating. It's early, but I don't see why we shouldn't start playing the guitar straight away and get a head start on that creativity skill again. Executive decision to stay off work today because we've got three mechanical skill points to get as well. We're not going to work. Sorry, you're just going to have to manage without us today. There you go, rock on, one large creativity point for Bella. This is what happens when you don't go to work. You're a lot more productive in things you actually care about. We've still got the party room upstairs, which I haven't really decided what to do with yet. Yeah, I don't know what's happening with that, but we've just got our bookcase up here. So we're gonna just grab a mechanical book and study for a few hours. Well, it's lunchtime, we're going to have a toilet break and then have a little bite to eat and I'd quite like to head down to the farmer's market on our day off and buy some seeds because I'd like to grow a little vegetable garden as our new hobby that we're going to be pursuing. So let's see, call cab, explore old town. We're going to go to the farmer's market. Yes, we would like you to send a shuttle. Off we go. Custer's Market, pick up some seeds for your vegetable garden or buy and sell the finest bounty Mother Earth has to offer. That sounds perfect for us. We're going to be probably getting some seeds because we want to grow everything ourselves if possible. The gardener is here. Let me ask him about garden care because I kind of want to know what I'm getting into. Taking care of your garden properly involves watering regularly, pulling weeds when they spring up and doing everything you can to keep pests away. I'm going to buy all types of seeds. Then when we get home, we can see which ones we want to plant. Oh, she can't get to it. Why can't she get to it? Bella is really tired and she's only managed to buy the tomato seeds. So I think we're just going to go home because we can get the other types of seeds later. We're just, we're just trying out gardening at the moment. This was just a quick flying visit to the market. And we've definitely got to go to work tomorrow, so... We're not going to have a ton of time to, to plant a huge garden right now. So off we go home. Bella is going to need to get straight in bed. In the plant tool, I think there is... I think it's this one. The Instaplot Victory Garden. If we place a few of these outside... Okay, well let's get up bright and early and plant some tomatoes. So we're just inspecting the earth. I should have known better to try and do this in the middle of the night. All this gardening is hard work. Bella's getting tired. She's like huffing and puffing. Let's just plant one for now and see what happens. And then come and have some breakfast. Unfortunately, we do have to go to work if we want to keep our job. So we're going to go now and then we'll catch up with our tomatoes later and I'd quite like to call over some sims because our social need is beginning to drop 
We've actually been playing it pretty cool with Benedict since the date. I mean, we haven't called him or asked him over or asked him out again. It might be nice to just to get him over tonight. We're back from work. Let's see how the plants are doing. Ooh, there's a little weed there. Let's weed water. What is going on with that car? Are there two dogs doing something they shouldn't in the middle of the road? It looks like it. We're gonna play our guitar because we need to... Actually, oh no, we don't need to get our creativity skill up. We really need to get our mechanical skill. But Bella would like a little bit of fun, so we're gonna play the guitar first. Okay, now it's gonna be nap time, and then we're gonna call over Benedict and possibly somebody else. Call Benedict. Invite over. I thought you'd never ask. I'll be over in a minute. Yes, you will. There he is. Did you bring me a gift? Oh, stop it. You shouldn't have. Oh, for heaven's sake. I think he's really falling for us, though. Bella, put the guitar down. Yes, that's right. And answer the door. We want to cheer you up because you're not in a good mood. Actually, we're not in a good mood, so we could really use the cheering up. But we'd also like to kiss you. <gasps> he rejected our kiss. I'm going to eat the chocolates you brought over. And you can continue to sulk if you want. But that was really disrespectful. I'm going to eat every last chocolate that you brought over. No, you're not. No, you're not having any Benedict. No, you can't do that. You can't just reject us in that way and then help yourself to the chocolates that you just gave us. That's very rude. We are eating all of them ourselves. Yes, we are. We will have a civilized chat with you because we need the social. Okay, good night, my darling. I will see you another time. I'm going to let our love blossom. I'm going to let it grow, but I'm going to focus more on growing my plants. Okay, you're not the only important thing in my life, Benedict. You know what? I think we might take another day off work. Um, we did go yesterday, so we shouldn't be at any risk of getting fired, and we're very tired. Stop relying on me. Like, I'm sure there's another teacher who can cover. High school band teacher, like, there's not band practice every day. Come on, that's ridiculous. Like, the kids have other classes to go to. No, stop, stop honking. You can drive on. Okay, I'm not having it. We're staying in bed. Our tomato plant seems to be growing a little bit. This is very promising. We are calling up Liliana who is the artsy woman we met outside our house one time. And we're going to invite her over and we're going to ask her to come and take a look at our garden that we're growing. Hey, Liliana. We're actually not friends with her, so it would be quite useful if we could become friends with her. Because we do still need one more friend for our job. You have made a new family friend. So now we are actually quite close to getting promoted. We just need two more mechanical skill points. Well, Liliana, if you'd like to stick around, I'm going to make some lunch and you'd be more than welcome to join. Like I said, I'm not going into work today. I am prioritizing myself. Yes, I am. And you should too. I'm assuming you're having the day off as well because you're at my house and not at your place of work. We're also going to play a spot of guitar if you'd like to listen. I'm sure your ears will thank you because we're extremely good. That's right, Liliana. You chose well in being my friend. Would you like to come outside and see my tomato plant? I think you would. We're gonna have dinner first and then you can come and look at the tomato plant. This is really nice. This is really fun. Having a day off work and having a friend come over all day. Whenever it's the evening, we're always really tired. We can only have friends over for a short time and then everybody needs to go. So I think this is the way to do it. Just take the day off. Where are you going, Liliana? Where are you going? Yes, this is my... Do not walk through my garden plots, please. Thank you. Where is she going? What are you doing? Oh no, there's more roaches down here. Liliana, are you going to tread on those? I know they're horrifying, but you literally... You walk directly towards them. You sort them out. I will come down and spray them for you, okay? Stop stamping on them. I'm trying to spray them. Honestly, Liliana, they're gone now. Stop it. You're being ridiculous. Liliana looks like she's leaving. You didn't need to come and interrupt me in the bathtub to come and say that. You could have waited until I was out. But it's fine. We are friends now, so I don't know. I'm not... No, you know what? No, I'm not comfortable. I'm not comfortable. I'm not comfortable with you seeing me like that in the bathtub. 
Well, you know what? It's been a successful day and we are going to have to go to work tomorrow, but we feel happier internally. Now, this afternoon when we get back from work, the first thing I'd like to do is check on our tomato plant and then really pursue these last mechanical skill points that we need for our next promotion because we're quite close now. So let's water the tomatoes. Let's plant some more because these have done quite well so far. We've not had any insects or gophers try to eat them. Let's water the new one. Let's study mechanical. I don't know if we'll be able to get both skill points now because we're already getting tired, of course we are. I think we'll just have to take the day off again tomorrow to get these points because they're going up so slowly. Okay, we finally managed to get a mechanical skill point. And we just have one more to get. And I've just noticed it looks like our tomatoes are ready to harvest. They look ripe. So let's just water those and then harvest them. So that was six tomatoes we picked. Put them away in a pantry or take them downtown and sell them. So we could actually eat these. We don't have a pantry though. I'm like, do I want to buy a pantry right now? We'll see, because I could sell them for profit. Yes, finally, we have the last mechanical skill point we need. Right, we're going to go to bed. And with a bit of luck, we'll get promoted tomorrow. I think we'll have time for just a bath before work. I don't know if there's going to be time to cook anything, because the car's coming just 45 minutes. Yep, the car is here again. Our performance is still average though, so I don't know. I don't know which way it's gonna go. But we've been in this position so long, I feel like we've been loyal. But then I say that, I'm like, we keep missing days of work, so maybe we're not really that loyal. <laughs> oh my gosh, we actually got promoted to Rhodey. Time spent tolerating the high school crowd was worth it. You are now cool enough to take your act on the road, setting up someone else's gear. Long hours are exhausting, but you're having fun and making the right contacts. You will need plenty of body skill to lug around all these amplifiers, but maybe something cushy will present itself soon. We are no longer working in a school. I think that is what we wanted. I don't know. I don't know if we want to keep pursuing being a musician. Maybe it's time for a new direction. I don't know. I feel we've gotten really good at the guitar and it would be quite good to keep improving that. It's really enjoyable and all our friends enjoy it and I think, yeah, it's an enriching activity. I think I'm going to leave this video here. I'll leave links in the description to the previous videos I've made with Bella if you want to check them out. And I will see you again in another video really soon. Bye!